So you see, as, as actors, we really only have one choice. It's either yes or no. But uh, if you're writing and, and you're creating your own work, you're, you're, you're making opportunities for yourself. Well, this is, this is my thinking, yeah. Well, exactly. And I mean, I'm writing a screenplay at the moment myself, and I find, that I find the process just exhilarating. Oh, uh, and um, what's the series about, if you don't mind me asking? Hmm, um, how to explain it? Um, you've seen me in X-Men? Yeah. All right, well, my character, Professor Charles Xavier, he can, he can control things with his mind. He can make people see things, make people do things. And I thought, well, wouldn't that be interesting if you could do that, but not in, not in a comic book way, but, but, but in the real world? Oh, right. Yeah, so uh, in my film, I play a man who can control the world with his mind. Right, that's, that's interesting. Yeah, no, I mean, for instance, um, uh, I'm walking down the street and I see, this, I see this beautiful woman and I think I'd like to see her naked and all her clothes fall off. All her clothes fall off. Yes, yes, and she's scrabbling around to try and put things back on, but I've, I've, I've seen everything. I mean, she's trying to pull her knickers on, but I've seen it all. Okay, so it's a comedy, is it? No. It's about, it's about what would happen if, if these things were possible. What, what, what's the story though? Well, um, I mean, I do other stuff. I, like, for instance, I'm, I'm cycling through the park on the grass and, um, and a policewoman says, Oh, you, you can't do that. And I'm like, oh, really? And her uniform falls off and, um, and she's, you know, trying to put everything back on. But I've, I've seen everything and uh, I get back on my bicycle and I, I cycle off on the grass. So it's, it's, it's mainly a story of you seeing women's tits. Mainly, but um, I, I mean, I do, I do other things. Uh, for instance, I'm, I'm, I'm at the World Cup final and England are playing and I think I'd like to be out there. And the next thing I am, and I'm out there on the pitch and I score the winning goal and the they, other players carry me into the dressing room and uh, Rooney's there and Beckham and, and Posh Spice walks in and- Your clothes fall off. Instantly. Sure. Yeah, and she doesn't know what's happening, but again, I've, yeah. I've seen everything. <coughs> Good. Uh, well, is there is there a narrative at all, or is there is there a story to this, or is it just? Well, I'm, a, I'm kind of a James Bond figure, you know, and I um, I have to go to Iraq and and rescue these hostages, and I get there, and uh, and and I, I do rescue them, but they're all women, and and they're all naked. Uh, because their, their clothes have rotted off and I, I get them in the back of the helicopter um, so they're behind me but uh, I have a mirror here you see so I can still I can still see uh, one of them is, is, is bending over two of them are kissing and uh, it's uh, yeah so they've turned lesbian yes you see they've been so long in the camp yeah, it can happen well good luck at that um, I've actually I've actually written a sitcom myself um, and I was wondering maybe like if you if you knew anyone you could just give it to someone. Absolutely. Is there um <clears throat> is there any is there any nudity in it? Any uh, any nudity, no, not really. Oh. There there, there could be. Uh, men or women? Either. Yeah. Just just, uh, just women. Oh, well, yes. Yes, I um I shall make it so. I'd, I'd need to rewrite, but um, yeah, if, if, if you know, in the meantime, if you could give it to give it to someone you no know problem. and TV or film, that would be oh, that's great. No problem, as I said, I will make it so. You've seen me in Star Trek. No, I haven't. No. Oh, your wife won't let you have it on. <laughs> I'm I'm not married. Oh, your girlfriend. Now. I don't have a girlfriend. I, I live alone. You're not married. You don't have a girlfriend. You live alone and you've never watched Star Trek. No. Good Lord. <laughs>